Earlier in the season, Bullard East beat Mayo, and that was the last time the Bulldogs tasted defeat. The rematch comes in the 6A state title game where Mayo looks for revenge and the Chargers chase history. Bullard East has never won the state championship. Mayo has lost three straight state finals, and the Bulldogs, they came out firing, looking to change things this time around. First play of the game, Lucas Cobbler out to Max Ganey. He breaks free down the sideline for 74 of his 153 yards. The opening touchdown makes it 7 to nothing. Mail would lead 14 to nothing. But back comes Bullard East. 14 7 now. Travis Egan rolling out, going to Mason Gauthier for the tying touchdown. Egan at 286 yards and four scores, tied at 14 at halftime. The Dogs get a field goal to take a 17 14 lead. It is a bigger lead now. Cobbler to Andrew Verbonchich, 24 14 at the end of the third quarter. Same score in the fourth. Egan has a counter punch, lofting a 15 yard touchdown. Nolan Davenport, no extra point, makes it 24 to 20. Mail adds a field goal to make it 27 20, but the Chargers have it with less than a minute to go. Egan stays patient, has an open Cameron Brogan to make it 27 26. They want to go for two in the lead. So what play do you call? It's called cheese steak, a trick play because it's a pass from Davenport to Egan for the win. Bullet East takes its first state championship by a score of 28 to 27. Our community deserved this and needed it, um, and so I'm just I'm excited that that our kids are the ones that are able to give that to them, and it's just uh, it's pretty special. Just it's such a well knit community. We're all close together, and it really feels like we moved a mountain doing this, giving this to our community. Not only our program, but it feels amazing. In 3A, a battle of undefeated squads, Bardstown and Christian Academy. Late first quarter, no score. Cole Hodge, he has been so good all year. Rolling to his right, heaving it up. And watch Trey Cotton. This is not an easy catch, but he comes down with it to make it 7-0 Cal. Hodge had 172 yards and three touchdowns. The Centurion defense has been dominant all year. No different this game. Nathaniel Heidenreich with the sack. Cal would pitch its sixth shutout of the season, and they had the points to support it on offense. Gavin Copenhaver breaks. Breaking loose, 225 yards in this game, two touchdowns. That's one of them. Cal takes the 3A title, winning 38 to nothing. They get what they've been chasing after falling short for a few years. There's not many teams across the state that can really come up short two, two years in a row and then still have an opportunity for a third. So just extremely blessed. And this is everything you work for. You work for this year round and to do it with two other seniors who I've played with my entire time at Cal since elementary school. It means everything to me.